This is the Scar City Studios YouTube channel. Please don't forget to like, comment, share and subscribe. And our sponsors are Alpha Claims and Hire, Birmingham, the leading and best accident management company. Get a replacement car anywhere in one hour. I really appreciate you joining me today and this is a breaking news story coming from North West London in Church Road. Two drill rappers, the Savin Chapel from iCity Boys, have been found guilty of the attempted murder of a man that was shot inside a property in Enfield. Asham Williams, 22 years old, from the Harrow area, and Mikhail Barnett, 21 years old, from No Fixed Abode, were convicted on the 13th of July after a six-week trial at Snaresbrook Crown Court. They will be sentenced on Friday the 24th of September in the same court. The jury heard that on the 23rd of February 2019, a two-car convoy containing gang members from the Brent area made their way to an address in Enfield and there was intent on causing harm. At one o'clock in the morning, Williams and Barnett and several other men broke into a home in the Enfield area armed with a shotgun. Three occupants inside the house, fearing for their lives, ran upstairs. The 26-year-old victim, unconnected to gangs, attempted to barricade himself behind a flimsy door and he pushed against it to try to save his life. At this time, a shotgun was fired twice through the door and it hit the victim in his stomach, causing life-threatening injuries. The attackers then fled the property, leaving the victim seriously wounded and they returned to the Brent area. The complex investigation was passed to the Trident detectives from the Specialist Crime Crime Command Northwest Hub. They interviewed an extensive number of witnesses and CCTV and mobile phone inquiries led them to identify and arrest a number of suspects. Although there was no forensics at the scene, painstaking analysis of automatic number plate recognition, AMPR, managed to put the defendants in the location. The prosecution was showed evidence from a drill music video, showed William and Barnett and featured other gang affiliates. The investigation revealed gang tensions around North West London and identified that as a motive for violence in the area. So this is more evidence that the police are fully aware of what is going on in music and they also document it and use it as evidence in court. So this wasn't necessarily to say that they rapped about the actual event, it's just to say that they are gang members Members and they are involved in crime so this goes against their character in a courtroom DC Anthony Sinclair from the Operation Trident said this was a mindless attack on a young man and the defendant's actions were callous and heartless effectively leaving a man to die at the scene the victim is still recovering from his injuries and the impact on the victim and his family has been devastating this has been a trying case and we are extremely relieved that a jury today has found them guilty and they are dangerous offenders and need to be taken off the street the victim's mother said as a result of being shot at close range with a faulty shotgun my son sustained significant injuries in the attack. On his road to recovery, he's undergone numerous surgeries and he's likely to be subjected to more to try to manage some of the damage that has occurred from the attack. The shooting was gang related, however the victim was not part of a gang and his life has been severely damaged and impacted forever. The chaos resulting from gang activity in the capital and ongoing petty disputes, the police say, has resulted in consequences for innocent people. CSB, Chapo and Sav have done music for quite a few years. They've done songs together on Mixtape Madness, Press Play and also Grime Daily as well. CSB, Chapo made no mention to fans of this actually happening and the court case. And he was doing a lot of music in the past few months. One song that did well was Rock and Roll back in October. And then he started to do multiple collaborations with a rapper called Screamer. And one of them songs in May was called Jenna. And he did nearly a quarter of a million streams on YouTube. He then switched it up with a more wavy trap type music. With a collaboration again with Screamer. But the hook was done by DTG. And he was definitely focusing a lot on music. Anyone from iCity Boys would know that these are the youngest from the estate in Church Road. For the rapper Nines, who is currently in prison himself. After being charged in relation to importation offences. So this is definitely going to be devastating news to fans of CSB Chapel and Sav. And I'll definitely keep you updated on what their sentences are. So please don't forget to like, comment, share and subscribe. Check out our previous uploads today and follow us online as well at scarcitystudios.com.